Hello guys, welcome to our channel. In this video, I'm talking about how to activate IOB mobile banking app and what are the things I need to have to activate IOB mobile banking app and what are the features they provide and how they helps. Okay, come let's talk. To activate IOB mobile banking app, first you need to install the app. To install, go to Play Store, type IOB mobile and tap on first one and install it and it takes some time in the time I explain what are the things you need to have to activate a UOB mobile banking app first you need to have your registered mobile number and your ATM card that's it okay okay come back uh, now tap on open and select your sim which is registered to a UOB bank and tap on send sms and then tap on proceed and now you can see here it's showing that register using customer id or account number select whichever you want i selecting customer id and i entering my customer id after entering your customer id tap on submit and then tap on ok now you need to create the passcode just enter a six digit passcode whichever you want but be sure on your passcode because it is the one which is required to log in the app after entering the six digit passcode re-enter it that's it and tap on submit that's it your 75 percent of activation is completed now log into app to log in just enter your six digit passcode and tap on I accept terms and condition and tap on login and now it asks for your fingerprint to access the log place your finger to continue and then tap on ok that's it now you can see here your balance and your account number on the top and there are several features like fund transfer card service service request voice asset check service and some other tap on next to all and now you can see here on the display is showing that do you want to set yum pin to enable the funds transfer for mobile banking service if you are interested in that tap on ok and now you need to enter your atm card details like card number card expiry date and atm pin after entering it tap on submit and create m pin be sure on your m pin because it is the one which is required to transfer the funds and re-enter your m pin and tap on submit that said your m pin is created successfully and now tap on ok now you get a one otp from your bank just enter your otp and after entering your otp enter your m pin that's it you are activated your iob mobile banking app successfully that's it guys thank you and one more thing if you got any doubt regarding to this video add a comment in the comment section and i made a video related to how to download bank statement using iob mobile banking app if you are interested in that you can go or you can go and see the video the video link is given in my description thank you guys thank you for watching if you like this video tap on like button below and do share the video and do subscribe thank you